three, two, one, zero. All engine running. Liftoff. We have a liftoff. Hi everybody and welcome back to Mission Control for a feature focus video. In this video we're going to discuss undo. There's an option to be able to undo steps. This will allow you to undo or redo up to 30 actions. A quick way to undo a step is to press and hold the AVO key and then back. You can also redo a step by holding the AVO key and pressing the AT key, which will also redo up to 30 steps forward. You also have an undo history window, which you can view by pressing the prompt area. This is just the left with soft key A, or by opening the undo history window from your open workspaces windows menu. Undo is a linear function. You cannot undo one step, say five steps back. You must undo the four steps in between now and then also. This is similar to a program like Photoshop. Not all actions are undoable. These are often noted with a circle slash symbol in the undo history window. So let's see that in action. I'm using the Titan Go interface on version 13. However, this will work the same all the way back to version 10. I will see here we've got the prompt area with this list of some of the items we've already undone. The last thing I did was unclear the programmer. If I was to right click on AVO or press the AVO key on a full console and then click the back key, I can see that I can undo the programmer that I had. If I click back again, I can see that I can undo that. So as before, then I can keep going back. If I click the at key instead, I can go forward in those and redo what I have undone. I can also open up the undo history window by clicking here. You now see that I have the history of things that I have done. If I was to click, say, back to here, we can see that it undoes all the steps back to there. Or if I scroll up in here, I can go all the way back to here. Or I can click forward on them and have it redo whatever items I wish. If something was undoable, such as deleting a fixture, so we'll show that here. We're going to go ahead and open our fixtures and groups window, go into patch click delete and select one of our fixtures and confirm it and we exit out of here. Now we can see that there's the circle slash icon in the prompt area here and also in our undo history. And we see that I cannot undo uh, past that because it's not a undoable action. That is the undo function in Titan. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe and join us next time. Thanks. Bye. Stop. Roger, we'll stop Discovery. Welcome back. A great ending to the new beginning.